Hi everyone, welcome back. Thanks a lot for joining me today. I just wanted to give you the finale for my Sweet On Project panning collab challenge. It's not really a collab, as in I wasn't originally in the collab, but I just hopped on in there. Everybody already doing it that I know of will be in the description bar, It, but it's exploded. There's probably loads and loads more people doing the um, collab now. So if you're watching this and you have joined in and you're not in the description bar, box leave me a comment and let me know and I'll update it and add you in so people can watch your video if they'd like to so um yeah let's let you know the progress it's not gone at all like I expected it to go I haven't got the fifth item with me today that was the almond sweet almond body butter because I finished that up my last update and I included it in an empties video and I've thrown it now away so that one I haven't got the packaging to show you but you can obviously go back and watch the video a last update if you'd like to the item that I wasn't expecting to finish, but did actually finish, is my um, Moon Dust number 17 polish. Um, I actually, you can see that it's completely empty. I actually tipped out the remnants of this onto a piece of paper to get a last application. And I did have just exactly the right amount for one more application on my fingernails, so that was ideal. Um, but obviously when it's the last application it's not the best finish and not the most long lasting so it was a bit bit gloopy but I got there. I've known a lot of polishes you're not, not to be able to get a final application out of so that's great. You know when you tip it out onto a piece of paper if you've ever done that even the ball sort of comes out and then you know you've done it so this is achieved and I wasn't expecting to. I thought I would end up just you know using as much as possible and having that and move on into another project but yeah that's finished up so I'm over the moon about that and I picked it because it has a nice sort of chocolatey look to it so it reminded me of chocolate and also moon dust the name sort of reminds me of that dust uh, crackle popcorn that's sort of like moon dust or whatever it's called I don't know if anyone has ever seen that um, this is exactly what I expected it to be I chose Plumpy by Barry M which is the jelly high shine nail paint because of you know jelly and um i wasn't it was brand new when i included it in the project i just wanted to make a dent in it so i have managed to make a dent in that and even though i've been moving on to other polishes since i finished the moon dust i've made an effort to continue to use this as a top coat um even though i knew there was no chance i'd be able to finish it before the finale so i only wanted to make a dent in this so that's sort of achieved although that's not really a measurable goal the other item that I expected not to finish up but make a dent in was white chocolate um, in my um, Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette which is here and I have expanded that pan quite a lot so since the last update I did hit pan and I've expanded that pan and I only expected or aimed shall we say to hit pan so that is achieved. And then the item that surprised me, the other item that surprised me is this lip scrub by Lush. I fully intended to completely use this up and it's in the scent popcorn and yet I haven't. I even took it away with me when I travelled for the week, I've been away for a week visiting family and yet I still didn't use it. My lips are actually sore because I've been sort of chewing on them because they needed exfoliating but I didn't exfoliate them and yet I still didn't use it. I don't know what's wrong with me, I don't know why I didn't use it, I really should have and I feel f still fully intend on getting this done. And moving it into some other project and actually getting it done but yeah disappointed myself there so it's a bit of a four out of a five situation which is what I expected initially I expected it to be four out of five and um, because I didn't think this would get actually get used up um, and yet it did so yeah so that's um, the project and how it's gone and um, let me know in the comments how you've been getting on although if you're doing videos along with the project I probably would have already been following you and yeah I hope that you enjoyed this little tiny project and um, if you do enjoy project pans then jump on over to my project use up I've got a massive project pan a yearly thing I did one last year as well and I'm also doing pan that palette this year and I think that's everything so it's a bit of a short one today guys I'll see you in the next one bye